How's it going, my fellow Hell Inhabitants? My name is Ruby Blitz. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. In this video, we are going to solo one shot Roblox's Rainbow Friends. Now, I'm not much of a horror game person who's playing them per se. I don't mind watching them. I love horror movies, but I'm a big chicken when it comes to playing horror games. Now, I've seen this uh, game float around up on YouTube. Uh, I've watched it be played by my YouTubers, Reasonly Gamer and 8 Ryan. Shout out to those uh, YouTube channels. They are great YouTube channels. If you want to go check them out, feel free to. Feel free to stick around, like, comment, subscribe to this video if you all want to see more videos. Thank you so much. Hope you all enjoy. Let's get started, shall we? Now the only reason there's going to be no respawning in this game, even though there's the ability to, is I want Robux or gems to do so. So it's just best to just try and one shot it. So we'll see how it goes, you know. All right, here we go. We're going on a field trip, y'all, to where? I'm solo because I just don't want to deal with all the people. <laughs> so I thought it'd be better to just try and be in a private server to try and solo this. We are going to a clerk called Odd World. But then the sign gets changed around. Yes, I have already played this a few times trying to get this video done. So yeah, I'm going to be doing a lot of spoilers. So if you haven't played this game or seen it, go ahead and check it out for yourself or you continue to watch. Well, I'm not really here to judge. I'm here to just play for y'all. And we crashed, and there goes my body being dragged away. Now there's five nights in the game. The first night we are gonna be tackling with 24 different blocks and just one monster called Blue. Now Blue is really idiotic because you can literally walk through it while you're in the box, or you can walk past you while you're in the box. As long as you're in the box when he sees you, you're good. If he does see you and you're not in the box, just get a little bit of distance away and then hide in the box and then he won't get you. So he's really simple to avoid. If you all want to read that text, by all means, go and pause the video or slow it down. And let's get started. So I noticed that the, the YouTubers I watched only carry one, but you can carry at least up to 10 blocks at a time. So I mean, that's really helpful when you're soloing this because it lets you get through it faster. Okay, that was a close call, so this is really my shot. As you saw, the direction I go, and then I go down, and then I come back around eventually from that entrance I came in to go to the other side of the map. There's three right off the bat. Is there one over here? Yes, there is. So there we go, we found four of the 24 blocks already on my own. Oh, okay, he sounds very close. I don't like that when he sounds that close. Should I get this into my phone? He's not very fast. Yeah, you saw nothing. Move along, you saw nothing. You saw nothing. You saw nothing. Yeah, 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 you saw nothing. Okay, and then in that room right there, don't even bother checking it. You pretty much never find anything in that room there, so that's a good idea to never check it. Um, you never find one hidden back there, but be careful because green tends to trap you down here. Green is the monster that you will encounter on the next night. You will see him later, 
but for now, let's go and hide my bark and do some great hopes. Let's go up this ladder. He will literally walk right through me. And now over in this room right here in front of me is what's known as Orange's Cave. Orange usually does not spawn till the third night, and he is up there. When he, um, you can come in here and feed him to keep him from coming out. If you don't uh, feel like it, you can always avoid him. He's pretty easy to avoid. You'll see him later, and I'll explain more. But for now, yeah, right now we're just dealing with blue. And there is 10 of 24. We are doing good, y'all. And there's one right there. Now you always want to bring them back over here to the theater. I did not mean for that, but it, it happened. Nonetheless, it happened. If we want to go this way from here. I can hear him stomping around. He is close. You can hear Blue stomping around. He is close by. I don't think he's here in this room. Now some rooms have multiple, like this room right here has two. And we have a three right here right off the bat, so let's see, we're really, really doing really good, aren't we? We've only been spotted once so far. We're halfway up to the 24, we just found 12, technically placed 12, we technically placed 12. But if I find three more, we are going to place more than that. Alright, we've already been this way. Hmm, let's go up this way. Right, now let's go over here. Let's turn these six in, and now to find the last five. Now there's one right here. Um, sometimes multiple spawn in this room. Yep, there's two. I've added up to three items in this room on it my own, so there's only two more we gotta find. Now, usually there might be at least one over here that we do. Oh, they spotted me. He's not very fast, thankfully, so you can get a good distance away from him. And yeah, like an idiot, he can just walk through you if he spots you like that. So yeah, like he's a pretty easy to avoid. Let me go through here. I don't think we've been here yet. Oh yes we have. We have been through there. Hmm. We've been through here. I'm trying to figure out which is the other way that I have gone. Alright. So you can see it glowing. Yeah, after a while the items start to glow, which is really helpful so that it tells you kind of where they are, where you can expect to find them. So it looks like it's down that way. So let's try and go that way. He sounds very close. Oh, yeah. Sure enough, I was right. He goes really right around the corner. Good thing I hit. And it's just, yeah, there it is. It's just down here. Gimme, gimme. Go back the same way as it came from. Now it can't get me while I turn the last block in, so there we go. Night night one done for y'all, soloed. And one shot, no dust, no dust. <laughs> now this is green. Like I told said before, green is rather annoying because he is 
blind, but I mean, if you're near him, he will find you. Like, even if you're hiding in a box. So if you see him, it's best to just run the other way. He does tend to stop and block paths because he sits there and waves his arms around like an idiot for a little while. So you just gotta either wait him out or walk the other way and find a different path to take along the map. He's rather easy to find as far as noise because he makes a squeaky toy noise while he walks. So. That's pretty funny, but it's still rather annoying. This night we need to find 15 bags of food, which is a lot simpler than 24 uh, blocks. Sometimes there's about 3 or 4 that spawn in the starting room right here. But yeah, let's go this way first, follow my normal path like I would. I think he's coming from right here. Yeah, good thing I freaking hid. Because he would have gotten me right then and there if I didn't hide. Now my path is not always the smartest path, but it is the most convenient path for me. You can take whatever path you want in this game. You can be randomly going throughout the map. As long as you wind up finding all the items, it doesn't really matter which way you take. So far we're already down three of... Oh, let's get this one. We're already down four of fifteen bags. There's one right here. Five. One third of the way there until uh, once we turn them in. One right here, hopefully green. I don't hear you squeaking, so I don't think green's coming down this ladder. I hope not, because I've been trapped before of him coming down this ladder. I haven't even heard green yet once, which is kind of worrisome that I haven't even heard him, because that means he's bugged. Blue is probably coming through right here. No, I don't see blue, but I he definitely hear him. Let's go in here. No, that's spawn in here. Let's go this way. I'm getting very concerned as to why I have not heard green yet. Cool, cool, cool. Two. Right off the bat. That's nine of fifteen. Ten. There's ten of fifteen. Okay. Let's go turn these ten in. Okay. And we'll grab this one right here. Doesn't seem to be one there right now. was very bad call, but I still did it. <laughs> that was a very close and bad call. I almost got caught by green there. So let's see, I think I need to go the same way green went, which kind of sucks. Have I been in here yet? Yeah, I have, but there wasn't one that spawned in here. Okay, 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 okay. Go around right here. Yeah, run, run away, big idiot. Let's go turn these three in. And then go from there. We're gonna go down this way because I don't think I've been down this way on the map yet. I did hear green squeaking. <laughs> Thankfully, you're faster. Yeah, that's right, you idiot. 
can't get me while I'm in the freaking box. Trying to figure out, I know which area I haven't been in, and there's green block in the path. So it looks like I gotta go the other way. I know where I haven't been, but it's the process of getting down to that area. Yeah, you see where they're, they're glowing from? I gotta get over there. Oh, okay, run the other way, run the other way, run the other way. Running the other way. Run the other way. Green is rather freaking annoying. here and then yeah it's down right here okay cool cool and it's 15 of 15 so that is night two done and blue can't get me because i'm gonna beat the night all right there's night two for y'all so night three right now you can see orange orange sits there and plays with the little food thing. Like I said, he has a set path, so he can't really get you that easily unless, like, he, you are near him. Like, near his path, not hiding. If you're hiding in a box, he won't get you. If you're on his path in a box, he will not get you. So it's pretty easy to avoid him. You, you can actually also technically go feed him, uh, which I will try and show you all me um, doing that. Or you can, of course, just continue to let him run along. He only goes off every once in a while. You hear the alarm blaring when he's going to start running through the map. He only loops his path once, and then he goes back to his cave. And then the other monster in this night is a little vent monster. You will see the vents right now and what they look like. If you see him hiding in the vent of that path, just wait till he moves because he moves around. Or, of course, just um, go the other way because trying to go through the vents when he's out, he doesn't always guarantee you'll make it through. Now this night we have to find 14 fuses. Sometimes in the starting room there's three that spawn right off the bat. But right now you only seem to see one, but that's perfectly okay. No, nope, wait, two. Nice, two, two fuses already down. But yeah, let's go this way, three. I don't see one back there. You can hear blue. Stomping up up here. There's a little vent monster for y'all. Like, yeah, I can't. You see, I can't really go through there without with him sitting there. So I'm gonna wait him out though because I'd rather you know go that way. And go around because I'm gonna get lost. I'm gonna follow my path. Little vent monster tends to sit there for a while, like um, green, green does. Orange. But yeah, see, orange runs right through you if you're in the box. He won't get you. So he's stupid, yeah, yeah, like blue. Because uh, his, his cave is right up here, so that's why he started pretty quickly right off the bat and running towards me. I'm gonna have to be in the box for a little bit because he's gonna come back around to his. He runs pretty fast through his path. I can technically go feed him. Nah, I'm just gonna wait him. Get him on his path. 
See, there he goes. Well, he ran his path pretty quickly. Let's see where to go this way. No fuses in here. Go this way. Sometimes there's one or two in here. At least one. There is one right there. Perfect. We are halfway done. As fine as. Idiot. <laughs> Why are you going back the same way I need to go, dude? Come on. That's exactly the way I need to go. Why are you going back here and down here? Freaking it. There's 10 fuses right off the bat, so let's go turn these 10 fuses in. And there's two in this room. You can hear the door is sitting there open. Okay, you don't see one over there, so... Oh, okay. Cold call. That was a very cold call. Okay, that's three. One more fuse to find. I can technically go turn in these three fuses, and then the fourth one might wind up. Be on itself when I turn this one in, because it's been a while since I found one. So yeah, let's go do that. Let's go turn these three fuses in. Correct. Go this way where screen went is where I need to no, not here. Mm, where is where is that path I need to take? I'm trying to find it. Ah, yes. I'm correct. There might be one down here. Yes, no, wait, no, there, never mind. I thought it might have been there, but apparently not. Anyway, let's, I think I have an idea of where it might be. Let's go this way, through here, and if I'm correct, yes, there it is. Okay, let's go turn in the last views. Well, this green is not right here, we are good. There we go. So that's nice three for y'all soloed, one shot. I have not tried yet, because I don't do any editing. So I promise you I have not died. And actually, you kind of would have seen if I died anyway, because you would have seen the monsters catch me. So, so far, I have done three of the five nights that there is without dying on solo. So, I'm doing pretty good. Now, this is fourth night here. We have to find nine batteries in the dark. You get a flashlight at the beginning. Uh, the nine batteries are pretty simple to find, but you have to deal with all four of these monsters, blue, green, orange, and the big guy, in this night while you're finding these nine batteries. <laughs> Now this is about the farthest I've made solo without dying. I literally actually was getting the last battery when the vent guy caught me. 
So yeah, that's definitely a fun night. Okay, green is coming. You can hear green stomping right there. Let's go the other way. Now that's the hiding spot right there. So really great idea to know that there's a hiding spot right there. Okay, one of nine batteries. Wait this guy out. Green is not coming through here. I don't see or hear him. Okay, it goes through here. There's not a battery there. Blue might be coming down that ladder, so we gotta take it careful. That is another hiding spot that you can take right there. Here comes orange. No batteries in here this time. So we're moving on. Can you hear Blue stomping on through here? I don't know if he's on the other side of this door or what. I'm surprised I'm not finding any of the batteries. Now if you hear orange, you better just wait until he's completely gone before you get out of the box because freaking he can get you otherwise. Batteries are being really tricky this map. Okay, cool, cool. So you've not yet been down here. either. Okay, that was a bad move. He's coming this way. Let's find another path to the theater at the moment. Because Green is coming after me. I have found a 7 of the 9 batteries, which isn't bad, but yeah, that doesn't mean that I'm completely home free yet, because I need to really find 2 more. And there's one more. Right, blue, we'll run along. Am I correct? There it is. And here we go. Night four done. That is night four of five done for you all. Solo, no death. For night five. Night five is just blue. Uh, the first part of it is rather easy because all you gotta do is just avoid the balloons and he won't get you. 
But the second part is you gotta open the vent first before he comes after you. Then you gotta run through the vent without being caught. <laughs> now I don't know the path yet of running through the vent, so I don't know if I'm actually gonna beat this per se, but I'm gonna try my best to get that last part done for y'all. If I already get the party ticket and redeem it, I get a little hot, so I don't think I'm gonna go and do that. But yeah, anyway, let this uh let this text go by and then we will try and beat it. But yeah, I'm not gonna get that little party hat, I guess it's not worth it. So just wait until this next night. Now you can't hide in the box from blue in this last part. You just gotta keep running. can't jump but yeah right now it's gonna show us this first part that red balloon pops and blue goes straight towards it so you gotta be very careful that he will not freaking get you and then you just gotta walk through all these balloons right here without popping them pretty simple straightforward because there's not that many on the ground and then you come up here and you grab a cake but that balloon pops and once it pops, you just gotta run this door. Alright, this next part is right here as soon as it lets me. Shit, let's run through this way. I'll be chasing off you through this way. Looks like it is this way. No, 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 the way, the way, the way, the way. All these red lights here. Crouch, crouch. Up the way, the way, the way, the way, the way. Okay, right here. Gonna start really stretching out a little bit, but yeah, we crouch through here. And then blue can't fit here. Actually, I'll throw clothes on him. And there we go, we have escaped. Yay, we survived. Solo one shot, no death. We have survived rainbow friends. But I will let you all see this in final cutscene and then we'll move on. And there's the guy that I've been talking to us the whole time. Alright, well there you have it y'all. This was Rainbow Friends on Roblox. If you all wish to hope y'all enjoyed the video and hope y'all see y'all in the next video. Thanks so much. Y'all have a great time in hell.